What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of Double Dribble. In today's episode, we're going to be doing another NBA Draft Player Breakdown. Before we get in the video, I just want to quickly say, if you're a fan of basketball, whether it be high school, college, or the NBA, please hit that subscribe button, join the conversation. We love interacting with you guys in the comments. Make sure you hit that like button, and please watch this video all the way to the end because it helps out more than you guys know. So let's get right into the video. Today we're going to be looking at Marcus Bagley. He is a 6'8", 215-pound freshman, a small forward from Arizona State University. In his freshman year at Arizona State, he scored 10.8 points per game, uh, 6.2 rebounds, 1.2 assists. He shot 34.7% from the three-point line, and he shot 39% from the field. So he had a pretty good freshman year and is now entering the draft. So let's go ahead and look at some of his strengths. So going ahead and looking at some of Marcus's strengths, um, I think one of the biggest strengths for him is the fact that he just has an NBA body, he has an NBA um, build, at 6'8", 215 pounds, uh, small forward, shooting guard position, uh, he's a pretty big body, he's got the size, he's got the, he's got the wingspan, he's got the length, um, he's got the strength to guard multiple positions on the defensive end, uh, he can attack smaller players on the offensive end. Uh, really, I think that's one of the main things he has going for him is just his his physical um, physical abilities. The fact that he's just NBA ready in terms of body. Um, another thing that is um, a huge strength of his is just the fact that he's able to stretch the floor, shoot the three. Uh, he can knock down open threes. He did only shoot you know 35% from three. It's not the end of the world, but um, needs to be improved a little bit. Uh, his shoot, his form looks really good, so. Um, Shouldn't be any problem, you know, just getting that percentage up, knocking down more open shots, hitting more threes. Um, he did um, attempt six threes a game, so to shoot six a game and, you know, make 35% of them, that's not too bad. Um, you know, like I said, can be approved a little bit, but that's just huge for him. He can be a 3 and D type of player in the NBA. Um, won't have a problem guarding multiple positions. Um, can knock down threes. Um, so I think honestly if a team late in the first round is looking for that type of player um, I see no issue drafting him um, at that late round pick So go ahead and look at some of his weaknesses um, One weakness is just the fact that he's not like a super crazy athletic player um, You know NBA teams nowadays love those players that can just jump out the gym uh, can make you know some finish at the rim of uh, finish above the rim I should say um, Just a crazy freak athletes those type of guys, you know NBA teams love he's not one of those guys You know he can move his feet. He's you know, he's athletic. He's mobile um, Not it's not a huge down um, downside of him But like I said if you are looking at some of his weaknesses that is just one that he's not um, an elite athlete I guess you could say um, another issue or weakness of his is the fact that really he just mainly scores off shooting open threes, catch and shoot threes. Uh, he doesn't have a whole lot of um, get the ball and go score type of moves in his game. Uh, he needs to work on that, just being more crafty with the ball, more shifty, um, getting his own shot, creating his own shot. Um, however, if he is drafted by a team to just be that 3 and D type of player, um, then really he just needs to just keep on working on his 3 and knocking down open threes. So. Um, honestly, just at his size and his, his frame, uh, if he can just knock down open threes and guard multiple positions on the defensive end, I think uh, many teams in the NBA would love to have him on their team. So in conclusion, uh, Marcus is projected to be a late first round pick. Um, I think any team in that late, in that late first round, um, if they're looking for a 3 and D type of player, um, a player that's um, Body-wise, NBA ready. Um, don't have to really worry about him too much. I would say, do not be afraid to pick him. Uh, you can, you know, shoot the three. He can guard multiple positions. He's got size. He's got length. He's got physical strength. Um, really, I think he's just overall a very solid player. And I think a lot of teams um, will love to have him on their team. So, uh, leave in the comment section down below your thoughts on Marcus. Um, let us know what you think of him. Make sure to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.